IFL TV in association with MTK Global. I'm at the MTK show in Brentwood today and with me I've got Jamie Carley. You've just defeated undefeated fighter Mikey Saki. Um, tough fight but you got through it and you won. Do you know what? I, I watched him his last fight and I, I thought I, I thought he's beatable and when they called us three weeks ago for the fight I mean I, I jumped it straight away and I just thank MTK for the opportunity. I thank the, the people that come out. I didn't do too many tickets and I was in the away corner but getting a short notice fight in the alliance then I feel happy with a win. Yeah, well, see, I know you come up a bit short against Georgie Wright, who the, the last time was undefeated fighter, he was an undefeated fighter, he was a bit gutted about that, but now you've, since yeah, someone's undefeated record, does that sort of bring him back to you? Yeah, of course it does. Listen, all the best with Georgie Wright. He lost a, a good GB kid, the last one out over six rounds. And I'm sure we'd do it again, you know? Here, take it, I'll take it, and, and good luck to George. I mean, yeah, he beat me fair and square on the night. And um, maybe we can get it on again. I think he's fighting Rakeem Noble next, so... Good fight, and hopefully <laughs> he can come through it. Rakeem's very good, and I wish him all the best in Japan when he moves over. Is he moving to Japan? Yeah, he's going to Japan. I, I see it somewhere on Facebook. I mean, we're friends on Facebook, as you are in the boxing scene. Yeah. But yeah, good luck to Rakeem, and I, I hope them to have a good fight. Obviously, really. more on the fight tonight. Tough fight, you both. He was at Adnan beating record. You, you've only had one loss, which is, could have gone either way. I mean, so tonight, was you really trying to go for it? Yeah, of course I was. I knew I'd step on him. I knew he, he didn't look too strong in the thing. He buzzed me in the fifth. Um, so I thought I have to come out in the six and I have to win the round. Um, yeah, he was quite strong. Um, I didn't think he was going to be that strong, but he was. He kept working when we were close, our heads were close. But I thought I, I kind of won every round, the fifth was close. I think he's a good fighter, he'll come again. You know? Um, what's next for you? Hopefully a challenge belt. My, my aim in boxing, you know, I'm 30, I've got two little babies, Mason and Ivy. And I'm getting married in August, so um, hopefully try and get one more in before August. Maybe not, because I've got my stag due in June, and that's probably going to be going? messy. I don't actually know. Me four brothers have sorted it out. And um, yeah, it's a surprise till the night, they tell me, you know, and I don't actually know. There's 30 paid for it, so there's 30 of us coming. Um, and hopefully, do you know what my aim in boxing is to get southern area? That's what I said to my manager before I started. I wanted a southern area, and if I get the southern area, then even just to fight for it, that's all I want. That is all I want, southern area. Not much. No, that's it. Great belt, though. Great yeah, belt. no, good belt to win, but... Um Obviously you said you're 30, South I mean... London here, look, South London chain, look, there is. <laughs> We're still early in 2017, so could you get that shot this year? Let's hope so. Um, my, my manager, Joey Powell, he, he, he's done miracles this year. Um, he's, got me, he's got me five fights, like he said he would. He said he'd get me more than five, probably six, and, and the year's not even out yet. Yeah. So it's only started, been, really. I've, I've only been a pro for less than a year, and I've already had five fights. So... Big things. I hand, I hand Big it to things Joey Powell. Oh, yeah, do you know what? I box anyone. You're like well, uh, wait, listen, you're, you're, like well, uh, well, uh, well, you're, you're a pleasure. You're a pleasure to manage and promote. You know what I mean? You fight. You want to fight anyone? Yeah, of course. Sometimes I have to pull him back because because he literally, if, if you put a twenty and one boy in front, of you, you go, yeah, I'll fight him. <laughs> yeah, you know, and, and and I've got a job to do at the end of the day. And, and this is, and you make it easy, mate. To the and job. this is why we've got managers because people like me, I fight anyone, but the managers slow you down a bit, put, pull you on the ground. Calm yourself down. <laughs> yeah, that's it. I mean, and that's it. I mean, we, we hopefully go for titles. And if I get one, I get one. If I don't, then I don't. All right, well, listen, Jamie, you've done the business tonight. Well done. I'm sure I'll catch you soon. But until then, thank you for watching IFL TV. Thank you very Fine, much. Man. I just Cheers. want to uh, thank my sponsors, well, Plush and Funky. Uh, without them guys, they paid for all my kit, they paid for my medicals. And without Alan at Plush and Funky, it, it, it wouldn't be possible. Thank Top you, man. mate. Well done. Cheers. Cheers.